There it is. You want to get it? Mm -hmm. Do you know what that is? No. It's the new disc golf bag. Oh. All right, guys, here it is. This is the Pound Octo Hall disc golf bag from Pound Disc Golf. Um, the first time I saw this bag was when I was playing Swords Ranch. Um, out in Montana, this was last year, and I saw Christian Dieterk with this bag, and I was asking my brothers, you know, you know, what kind of a bag this was, and they said it's a pound disc golf bag, so I looked him up, um, been looking into getting this bag now for about a year, and finally decided to make the purchase on getting a bag. So, as I was saying, I did the Octa Hall, which is a little bit bigger than the Octothorpe. I was able to do a custom bag, so I had to basically choose between the Octothorpe and the Octahall, and I think for customizing it, there was only like a $25 difference, so I decided to get the Octahall, which is the bigger one. So, here it is. So they put the uh, rain fly, I already put the rain fly on it, so this is what it looks with the uh, rain fly. Um, this one of course is black, they have a bunch of different colors. I don't know how to take this thing off, let's see. So that's how you get into the bag. Okay, I'm going to take this rain fly off real quick. So there's a button on the back here that secures that, and then that just comes off the front here. So it looks like it's pretty easy to put on and off. So that's the, that's the rain fly, I think it's like 65 bucks. So here's the bag, so first of all I thought it was going to look a lot bigger than what it than what it does look, but I think once you get these um, expanded it's going to look a lot bigger. Come with uh, drink holders for the side pocket, I actually didn't know that it was going to come with this, I thought this was something that you had to purchase as extra, but that's cool that it came with that. So here's the inside of it. There's a spot here for your mini. It goes right there. And then inside here, we got pound disc golf pack sticker. Probably give this to one of my kids. They like stickers. Um, there's a place here to put something. Yeah, there's a little button here and then there's this little zipper pouch. And this thing goes pretty deep. I've got big hands and it goes all the way down to my wrist. So that goes, it goes clear down inside the main compartment right there. And then there's another zipper compartment back here, which just goes, I think that goes to the main frame there. This might be where you're supposed to put the uh, the bladder. I didn't get a bladder, I already have a bladder, and so I'm just gonna use my own bladder, as long as it fits. If not, I might have to get one, but I think that's where the bladder goes. So this looks like it can go inside this little pouch here, and then there's the button, and that secures it, so that way you have a place here for your discs on top. So,
this is a pretty big pocket here. There's another smaller pocket here. You can put wallet or phone. So one of the reasons why I decided to get a different bag is playing some of these tournaments during the practice rounds. I wanted a way to be able to take more discs with me. So I had extra discs. And so that's one reason why I looked into getting a new bag. And that's one reason why I chose to go with Pound because they have a pretty big bag. Uh, most of my brothers have a grip bag, which I think is also a good bag. I think most of your pros and amateurs have that bag, but I think this is the this is where it's at right here. So here's another pocket out here. This can also be used to uh, put extra discs in. Same thing. They have this little pocket here that then you can fold that down into. I guess in one of these sides, I'll probably have some my drinks. I'll probably carry water and then Gatorade on one side, and then I'll have my extra discs on the other side. So that's super nice. And then this side, same thing, has the same pocket as on the other side. I think this is for your umbrella. And then it's got your pencil or Sharpie spot there. And then same thing, a lot of extra room here for a jacket. That's another thing with being out here, um, especially in the spring and early summertime, you play in these Northern Idaho tournaments or um, Missoula, you know, Montana tournaments, it can get pretty chilly. And so it's nice to be able to have a place for a jacket or a hoodie or your rain jacket and then as well for the rain fly so anyways i think we're going to put some discs in here so we can see what it looks like with discs so other than that i'm pretty happy with how it looks um i went with navy on top and bottom and then with the red on the inside um anyways it looks really sharp i'm super happy to to check this thing out Okay, so here's a side-by-side -side comparison of the Dynamic Disc Ranger bag, which is what I did have, and then the new pound um, Octahol. So it fits two of these Hydro Flasks in there pretty easily. So I have about 19 discs in the main pocket. I think I have five out here in this compartment, and then I have five putters up here. So that's 29 discs, not bad. Um, I think this will be very beneficial when it comes to practice rounds and then tournament rounds. Um, it just does a lot better than this Dynamic Disc Ranger. Um, this thing was completely full of discs and I didn't have any place to put any sweatshirts or hoodies or jackets. So, Anyways, this is what I'll be throwing for the 2020 season um, and hopefully for years to come. I'm super excited for this year as soon as we get the stupid virus to go away. I can't wait to get out there and start throwing some discs again. Anyways, hope you guys have a fun week, and yeah, check out the pound bags.